I'm Jim, and I'm from Ohio. I've been a Republican since I first voted for Ronald Reagan back in the 80s. And even though I haven't always agreed with the direction of our party or the party leadership, today, as it stands, I can no longer support what our president does, says, or what our elected officials in the party are doing. We currently face a tremendous crisis that's sparked by the death of an innocent black man. And our, I, I can't even call them leaders, our elected officials are absent. And the only time that they are actually involved is to threaten with more violence or to call out the, the military. This to me is absolutely unacceptable. I cannot call them leaders. Leaders rise to a challenge. Leaders walk us through these challenges. Currently, our party is not doing that. We have no viable foreign policy, and we have no viable foreign policy because we don't have an effective domestic policy. Coming off one of the worst health and economic crises in our generation, one would think that the president and the party leadership would seize on this opportunity to help us through this. Instead, it's peppered with rhetoric, threats, and lack of any type of viable leadership from our elected officials. Our president needs to be defeated in November. I will not support him. I do not support him. Many of our elected officials from the party need to go as well. I do not support them anymore, and I cannot, in good conscience, vote for them anymore.